Hi everybody, this is Beth Allen. I am the Director of Congregational Life at Spanish Fort United Methodist Church and happy to be bringing you um, our third installment of Pray Down at High Noon. Um, hope you are uh, also joining us on Sunday mornings on Facebook Live for worship. Um, and we are just trying to stay connected with you all. Um, please make sure you're calling the church office if there's anything that we could do for you um, or um, anybody that you know of. So I invite you now as um, we go to this time of prayer, um, we'll finish with the Lord's Prayer that I hope that you will pray with me. So um, Paul tells us in um, his letter to the Thessalonians, his first letter, um, that we are to rejoice always, um, pray without ceasing, um, giving um, thanks in all circumstances for this is the will of God in Christ Jesus uh, for us. Um, so when I think about prayer, I know that um, many of us st struggle sometimes with worrying about the right words to pray or the right things to tell um, God when we are speaking to him. And um, the first thing is God just wants us to speak um, to him from our heart, and there are no special words. But um, there are some tools that I wanted to give you if you um, struggle a little bit with prayer. Um, first of all, you can use your hand, um, your five fingers. And if you think about the beginning of a prayer being um, the praise, um, we praise God. Sometimes we use the Psalms for this. Um, and we thank God um, and praise him and um, show love for God. That's sort of a, a way that we worship. Um, the next one is Thanksgiving. Um, we thank God for the many blessings that we have, and we certainly do have many blessings. Um, the third is confession. Uh, this one we all struggle with a little bit, uh, confessing our sins um, to God um, and asking for forgiveness. Um, the fourth one is a petition, and that's asking for God's help um, for ourselves and for others. Um, and the final one um, would be offering ourselves to God and inviting God to use us um, for his mission. So um, we're going to pray together, and I invite you to um, pray with me as we um, say a prayer together, and we will finish with the Lord's Prayer. Most Heavenly Father, we truly praise you, and Lord, um, you are the creator of all. Um, Lord, we love you, um, and we come to you in this time of prayer and worship you. Lord, we are thankful for the many blessings that you have given us. Um, we are very blessed to live in a beautiful place, um, have sun shining today. Um, and Lord, we are thankful for that, thankful for um, a great community and a church family that can come together. Um, Lord, we know that we have um, not done things that we should have and done things that we should not have. And we ask for your forgiveness, um, Lord, for all those things, um, our sins that um, we are aware of and those that we are unaware of. And Lord, we know that there are many needs in this world. Lord, I just ask specifically today for your um, protection. Um, Lord, um, I want to pray today specifically for healthcare workers um, and those who are having to be in the front lines of um, still being around people, um, Lord, um, trying to do their jobs, Lord, people who are working in grocery stores and pharmacies, um, people who are just trying to keep things going so that we have what we need, Lord, especially for those who are providing for health care for us. Lord, we just ask your blessings over them. We know that this is a scary time, um, that you would bring them comfort and bring a hedge of protection around them, Lord. Um, finally, Lord, we ask that you use us in a way to um, carry out your mission in this world, even in these um, interesting times, these crazy times that um, we have not experienced before. Lord, guide us and direct us that we may be your hands and feet um, to the world and show your love each and every day. I ask you now that you pray the Lord's Prayer with me. Our Father, which art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory forever. Amen. 
thank you for joining us today and um, I appreciate you tuning in um, and stay safe, stay home if you are able to, and we will continue our prayers for you.